plays and then we'd make plays and they'd make plays and you're kind of looking for that uh, you know, a little more consistent effort out of both sides. And, you know, you, you really don't want one side just to massively get the upper hand and we've had, I thought, too much of that. You know, it'd be like, uh, you know, one day defense would, uh, would hammer the offense, next day offense would hammer the defense and so you'd like to see uh, a little more consistency to it. In, in other words, neither side uh, putting together a streak of bad plays. Is it tougher for the defense early on in camp in 11 on 11 <coughs> to kind of adjust to the offensive game plan and philosophy? I've always thought initially, uh, initially it's tougher on the defense and then as camp goes on, it's tougher on the offense because they see the same things over and over. Yeah, um, you know, and almost unconsciously, sometimes they start jumping to the spot, you know, but um, I think, uh, you know, early on as uh, <coughs> they're getting their communication down and things, I, I, uh, it, I you know, I, I don't know where the tipping point is. It seems to be about, uh, uh, well, I mean, they're, they're closing in on us now, you know. Have any of the younger defensive guys stood out to you so far? You've got a whole bunch of young DBs. Yeah, quite a few. If you mention one, I can probably, I, you know, there's we got quite a few faces out there. George Hicks? Doing some good things. So George has played real well. George has a nose for the ball. If George, uh, <coughs> you know, sometimes he'll undercut it or be too aggressive when we get behind him. But, um, you know, he's, he's really quick, turns his hips good, and, uh, and you know, finds the football. So. Um, George is uh, doing a really good job. As a matter of fact, George uh, <coughs> of the corners probably had the best day today. How about Sean Harper? He's doing good. Uh, uh, kind of a bigger kid. Um, but uh, no, Sean, uh, Sean kind of rangy, uh, and he's done a good job out there. Where have you seen Isaiah Johnson Mack really grow since, since you saw him in the spring? What has he done this summer to kind of take his game to a new level? Uh, he's a little stronger. I think he's a little stronger. He's in a little better shape, and then uh, he's more consistent. You know, I think he's become more consistent. You know, if he's if he has a bad play, he doesn't dwell on it and comes back and you know makes a play the next time. Some coaches have certain ways to diffuse and handle fights at practice. Today was kind of the first time we saw some extra energy. Uh, do you like seeing that, or or what? Oh, what's uh, the, if they don't take too long, you know, I mean, they better get about their business pretty quick or I'll just put them on the next field and roll them or something. But, you know, because everybody else is sitting there waiting. Um, in the first couple of weeks, uh, I'd let it go some. And then, you know, then after that, <coughs> tighten up on it, you know. Mike, what kind of long-term uh, upside do you see in Jalen Thompson? Uh, well, he keeps getting better. I mean, he's just really explosive. He's really athletic. Um, naturally, a kind of a really optimistic guy. You never see him get down. Um, you know, and he plays extremely hard. And I think even guys, uh, he's been a pretty good example of guys older than him as far as playing hard. And, uh, <clears throat> you know, some of his improvement, uh, uh, you know, like anybody, you stay on him, but some of his improvement takes care of itself a little bit just because he pushes himself so hard. And he was, I think, one of those guys that didn't, as you say, have a lot of clutter early. No, he doesn't have a lot of clutter. He comes out here like he belongs here and, you know, figures, uh, you know, he can uh, beat up on some of these guys that have been here and does, you know. What are you hoping to see from uh, Eric Powell as a fifth year senior? And obviously knows the ropes, but just more consistency this year? Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Uh, because he's got a real strong leg, and uh, he's got a real strong leg, and so I think that part's good. And then, uh, you know, because he, he's got the range to hit it as far as anybody, um, but just be consistent. Thanks, Coach.